lads, for the love of all that is holy, I've never clapped eyes on your poor sister. Drop the act, hag. You was the last to see me, Rena. Just let her go. Please. Thank goodness you're here, sweetie. I, I don't know what's come over these boys. Stop this. We... We won't ask again. Careful. Don't trust a word out of her mouth. Our sister went to the hag, and we ain't seen her since. Hand over heart, I don't know their sister. I will gladly help you all look for her, though. Enough. Where is she? Sweetie, be careful! He's with the hag! Don't bloody stand there gaping. Get him! So much for peace. Fall by my hand. Demir! Demir! Time to strike. with me. This is all my fault. But I made a promise. Marina begged me not to breathe the word if they came looking for her. And my word is my bond. That poor thing would be distraught. We can't let her know it would break her poor heart. I'd best get going, but please stop by my house. I'd like to thank you proper. Ethel's less helpless than she made out. I don't trust her. chill runs up your spine. You feel like you're being watched. The place has a quiet sense of calm. You can't see anything strange. everywhere. Someone wasn't as fortunate in their choice of campsite as us. No ordinary creature did this. Red caps ripped the place to pieces.
Ah, a fellow wanderer. Forgive the uh, aroma. You catch a waft of something foul, metallic, and sickly sweet. Powdered iron vine. Most monsters will think twice before making a meal of me. An old hunter's trick. If you can't mask your scent, spoil it. Today, the same as you. A humble supplicant come to bargain with the lady of this house. That is why you came to her lair, I take it, to bargain. A more innocent name than some I could call her. But it is what she is that ought to concern you. Her kind have hidden among us since the first darkness. And their knowledge is matched only by their spite. Know how to ask, and they'll share that knowledge. If you're fool enough to pay their price. Whatever's easiest to lose, and the hardest to do without. But the thing I hunt has gone to ground. If she can tell me how to draw him out, I'll pay whatever she asks. Scream, turn, run the other way, that's what I'd like to say. But bad as she is, I'm betting whatever drove you to her door is worse. So instead, know you're outmatched. Know what you're willing to give. And mind your manners. I don't want a crumb left on that plate, girl. Auntie Ethel, please. One more bite, and this pie is gonna come back up to say hello. Don't make me get the wooden spoon. You're eating for two, so get to it. Oh, if it isn't my hero. You took ages. Come in, come in. Feel free to relax yourself and have a cuppa. Gods, grant me patience. Eat up, Mayrina. I won't say it again. Beautiful, isn't it? It's my little refuge for the lost and hopeless. People in dire need travel from all over Faerun to see little old me. And I do my damnedest to help them. And you, Petal, well, you need a lot of help. That wriggler swimming in your brain juice is a bit of an inconvenience, isn't it? Because you stink. And I know the stench of mind flayer anywhere. I can tell you're almost done cooking. You know, you could turn just like that. What do you say? Want me to take care of the little bugger? Ethel, can I please? Quiet, you've had enough pampering. And you, my door is always open, Petal. Auntie Ethel is here for 